happened here? Martin, sir! Martin! It's me! Professor, what are you doing here? I thought you went back to Yale. Well, I did, but uh, I came back uh, for another round of research, <laughs> and now all hell is quite literally broken loose. What is going on? Well, well sir, I'm a man of science, a man of great learning, a, a thinker, a, a wise man, and I'll be honest with you, sir, I haven't got a fucking clue. Why ain't that dandy? What, what should we do? Well, I suggest we try to find other survivors, band together, and find a cure, or fight to the death trying. Well, well that sounds great and all, but, uh, but I'm uh, just peachy, but, but I'm not sure that I'm, I'm not cut out for such shenanigans. Uh, I was thinking more that uh, finding a horse and, and riding back to the civilized north at the speed of knots before writing a paper on the events from the comfort of my study. I'm a scientist, after all, right? I mean, I, I, I can't do much science if I'm some bloodshot dervish's lunch, can I? Much as I would like. Your sense of duty is very impressive, Professor. I'm gonna search the back street for survivors. No, no, be, be, perhaps staying with you would be safer. Uh, could, could you just wait a sec here, would you please? I, I'm going to wander down that lonely, deserted street and get my bag. Wait, you should stay with me, Professor. You haven't got a gun. Oh, no, no, it's okay. There's no need to worry. Everyone's already dead. <laughs> I left my stuff with Mr. Nastas. Uh, you remember him. Uh, Indian fellow, dumb as bricks, but, but a good sort. Okay. Well, meet me in a couple minutes. Affirmative. A couple of minutes. <sighs> Anyone here? Hello? Anyone here? In here, mister. Come out. It's okay. Come out. I don't bite. Bad joke. I mean, come out. They got my family, mister. 
And mine, I fear. I saw my mama rip my daddy's face off and drink his blood. And they were happily married 20 years. I'm sorry. We were so glad to see my mama. Because she's been dead for three years from the smallpox. Your mama was dead? I saw her walk up onto the porch. And then, boom! She ate my daddy. You weren't... You weren't a bad man, mister. You weren't. Sure, he liked to drink, but, but he weren't bad. And sure, he liked the company of women, but he weren't bad, mister. He weren't. No one deserves to have their blood drunk. I mean, he knew how to use his fist. And if, if a woman spoke out her place, he reminded her of it and everything. And when my mama was dying, people said that he was lying with her sister. But that weren't true, mister. It weren't. But you said your mother was dead. Yeah, her and Mr. Braithwaite. He's been dead a year. And then yesterday, he walked up that street eating dogs. And he loves animals. All the dead folk have come back to life, mister. Only they ain't happy. It's a funny kind of salvation. All the dead folk? All the folk buried at the cemetery over by the churchyard. My God. I'm gonna go have a look. You wanna come? No, I already seen my mama. I don't need to see any more of my relatives. Here, mister, take this. If you can burn them, maybe you can put their souls to rest. I, mister! If you see my uncle Mordecai, you burn him. Burn him real good, you hear? Come <laughs> on.